Okay, well, you might like to fast forward just to check your solution because I'm going to take you slowly through it. So first of all, what I'll do is copy down the question. You'll notice, by the way, I've put the identical sign. I prefer that rather than having the equals that was given in the question. So what we need to do next is factorize this quadratic expression in the denominator here. So I'd copy that down. And if you factorize that quadratic, you should have something like this, x plus 3 times x minus 2. Next, we would want to put this all over one denominator. And I can see that if I was to multiply top and bottom of this fraction by x minus 2, I would create the same denominator, OK? x plus 3 times x minus 2. So let's just put that all over that common denominator there and we would have this line. OK, so next I just need to expand the brackets on the top. Doing that, you should find that you get x squared minus 2x plus 6x plus 3. Then I need to just group up my terms here on the top and I get x squared plus 4x plus 3. And I can factorise the top. Factorising the top gives me x plus 3 times x plus 1. And I can see now that I've got a common factor, that is the x plus 3. So I can divide through top and bottom by x plus 3, going once there, leaving me with what we've got to show, x plus 1 all over x minus 2.